guys, it is time for me to make a remake Dark Truth video on Foxy the Fox 110 the TPL fan. But this time it will be added with better details. Now before I begin, if you guys are still trusting Foxy, then please cut ties with her because she made Leah's life in a living hell. I am not trying to bash y'all's opinion, it is just advice. But anyways, let's get started. So to tell you guys the truth, I never liked Foxy in the first place, and I didn't even join her god awful toxic fan base either. Here are the reasons on why she really sucks. One, she takes me away way 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 to the fucking extreme and treats her like she is in the Vietnam War in 1955. Like come on, if you don't like Leah, then just ignore her or don't watch her videos. It's that simple. Two, she made Leah's band break up twice due to her being upset. Like what the fuck Foxy. This proves that you like to ruin someone's music careers for fucking fun. She claims that the criminal supporter term is not a real term, when it actually is. And Foxy, you need to get your fucking brain fixed because you are fucking dumb as shit. 4. She is a grave digger. Why? Because she brought up Leah's past by saying that she threatened Mario Gamer 2's dog to eat chocolate when it was from the past. And yes, I know what Leah said was a serious crime and it was very not okay. But Foxy has no rights to bring up her past like that. She supports HK13 and Oswaldo the racist Puka fanboy who dated an 11 year old minor named Shane, proving that she is a criminal supporter. 6. She is a hypocrite. And I will show you examples of Foxy being a hypocrite. She claims to hate slandering, yet she slandered Frankie Coon for being a pedophile to Ruby. She claims that she is not a manipulator, yet she keeps manipulating Leah's friends to cut ties with her. She claims that she stopped supporting pedophiles like Wilson Perez, yet he supports Oswaldo the racist Puka fanboy who dated an 11 year old minor named Ching. And she claims that Leah said the N word, but yet she said the N word on Discord. And those are the reasons on why Foxy is a hypocrite. 7. She is a manipulator. Why? Because she keeps on manipulating Leah's friends to cut ties with her and making her upset. Like what the fucking hell Foxy, that was very messed up of you to do that. 8. She treats the stupid panther lover like he's a gift from God proving that he's a toxic fan brat out of the stupid panther lover. 9. Her fan base is 100% toxic as fuck. 10. She gave Leah a false hate base two times causing her to be upset. 11. She made Leah evil and made her almost kill Dilly and Godzilla with her dark powers on his live stream, which was very messed up. 12. She cannot handle her own hate and criticism whatsoever. Like come on Foxy. Handling hate and criticism is a simple thing to do. 13. She denies the fact that she is a pedophile. Well guess what Foxy? You are a pedophile, so don't deny it. 14 and finally, the worst part, is that she made Leah go into diary mode on Elijah's livestream and was the main reason on why Leah's hate face got toxic. Like what the fuck Foxy. Look what you've done. You have made Leah act like this because of your motherfucking bullshit behavior. This is all your fucking fault Foxy. Fuck you. No seriously. Fuck you. So yeah. Those are all my reasons on why Foxy the Fox 110 the TPL fan sucks. And Foxy, if you're watching this, you better not do a response on me. Or else I will have Edward Toys, AJ Raider, Frankie Coon, Rush, Davi Grutkowski, Jacob, Elijah, Ruby, Cooper, and Night Panther to deal with your ass. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. Goodbye, and have a wonderful day.